Hello friends, welcome to NEP Solutions. Friends, in today's video, we are going to solve BSc third semester physics question paper, wave motion and optics regular question paper. Before starting the video, if you are watching our video for the first time, please subscribe to NEP Solutions and press the bell icon to get instant notifications. Let's start the video. As you all know, the time is 2 hours, maximum marks is 60. Instructions to the candidates, calculator is allowed to solve problems. Write intermediate steps. First we will solve 2 marks questions. Answer any 6 questions. Let's see the questions. What are different types of wave motion? Write two uses of Lissajous figures. Third question, what is the resonance? D. Define reverberation and time of reverberation. E question, what are conditions for constructive and destructive interference of light in Young's double slits experiment? F question, define wave front, mention its types. G question, Write any two comparisons between zone plate and convex lens. H question. What are positive and negative plates with respect to polarization of light? So guys, these are the two marks questions. They will give eight questions. In that, we need to write answer for the six questions. Then we will get 12 marks. Next, we will see four marks questions. Answer the questions A and B or C and D. We need to answer for only two questions. Either A and B or C and D. Let's see the A question. Derive expression for intensity of progressive wave. We need to derive the expression. B question. The wavelength of a note on sound of frequency. 512 hertz at 27 degrees celsius is 0 0.65 meter find the ratio of two specific heats of air given its density to be 1.293 kilo per meter cube or or question it is c derive expression for resultant displacement of a particles due to superposition of two collinear oscillations having equal frequencies. I will read the question once again. Derive expression for resultant displacement of particles due to superposition of two collinear oscillations having equal frequencies. D question. A progressive wave travels from medium 1 to medium 2. Its wavelength in two media are 0.2 meter and 0.3 meter respectively. If the velocity of wave in medium 1 is 130 meter per second, what is the velocity of wave in medium 2? Also calculate the frequency of wave. So this is the D question. Next main question number 3. Here also same answer either A or A and B or C and D. First C, A and B question. Derive an expression for velocity of wave along a stretched string. Derive an expression for velocity of wave along a stretched string in terms of tension T and mass per unit length M. B question. The resonating volume in Helmholtz resonator is 120cc for tuning fork of frequency 480Hz. Calculate the frequency of tuning fork if the resonating volume is 105 cc. Or question. Derive Savine's reverberation time formula. Derivation it is D question. Sum is there. Calculate the intensity of sound wave if its intensity level is 110 decibel. Given that I0 is equal to 10 raised to minus 12 W per meter square. 
the numbers which are given in the brackets are the marks 8 and 4 next main question number 4 let's see the A and B question first how do you determine wavelength of light by using free frisnel by per by prism how do you determine wavelength of light by using fresnel dye prism 8 marks question it is B question the wavelength of light source is 6000 angstrom what is the distance between third and fifth dark fringes in an interference pattern formed by this source of light given that the distance between screen and plane of slit is 1.2 meter and slit width 1 meter for marks question it is and c and d questions we will see now give the theory of newton's rings theory of newton rings d question newton's rings are observed in reflected light of lambda 5.9 into 10 raised to minus 9 sorry 10 raised to minus 5 centimeter then the diameter of the 10th dark ring is 0.5 centimeter find the radius of curvature of the lens and it carries four marks last mean answer the questions a and b or c and d same here a question explain fraunhofer diffraction through a single slit draw the intensity distribution curve 8 marks question b question what is the radius of the first hop period zone in a zone plate behaving like a convex lens of focal of local length 60 centimeter for a light of wavelength 6000 angstrom or questions are c question explain the production of circular and elect elliptical polarized light explain the production of circular and elliptical polarized light d question a 200 millimeter long tube containing 48 cm cube of sugar solution produces an optical rotation of 11 degree when placed in a polarimeter or saccharimeter if the specific rotation of the sugar solution is 66 degree calculate the quantity of sugar contained in the tube in the form of solution so these are the four marks questions so this is your physics major question paper of bsc third semester i hope you all got the correct question if you have got any doubts or if you have any queries feel free to ask comment us down thank you for watching see you in the next video bye bye